it's very annoying to be starting a 100 day practice challenge <laughs> and not actually be able to practice. Welcome to day two of uh, Hilary Hans hashtag 100 days of practice. If you saw my video yesterday, you'll know that I'm a bit injured. I've got like a frozen neck and shoulder. Hopefully the physio will help me tomorrow. I've still got to do a day two of some sort. I'm not giving up. I will do a couple of like very easy light exercises. There's one that Hilary does. She always starts with it, day one. I've never tried it, so I'm gonna give that a go in a second. But first, I wanted to read you what she wrote last year. This was her fifth season, she's now on her sixth one. But I have failed the last two times. <laughs> so, third time's the charm. To participate in 100 days of practice, all you need to do is participate. Short practice is good, long practice is good, other instruments are welcome, other art forms are welcome, days off are productive if done with intention. Um, there are no pass or fail grades. If you miss a day, you're still in the 100 days, you're still a part of this. And I think it's fair to say that we all still support you. Don't give up. Don't let frustration in. Stay in the project. That's the 100 days. And that's what I didn't do last time. I crashed and burned at 60 days <laughs> because I had a play to do and I quite simply didn't have time to do both. And I wish I'd let that count and I wish I'd kept counting. I am going to try out this left hand exercise that she does. I'm going to be rubbish at this because I've never done it before. <laughs> but this is always Hillary's day one. I don't know how she makes hers audible. How does she do that? How does she do it? I know, it seems like all I'm doing today is reading to you. If I'm not playing, then I'm not straining my shoulder either, so that's a good thing. I've just found this article on the Strad, which is Hilary talking about how she warms up. I used to warm up with etudes, scales, and technical exercises, but I've realized over the years that it wasn't the best idea. That's partly because starting in this way tends to make my arm cramp up, and partly because I'm not completely agile when I begin my practice, so it was counterproductive. Now when I warm up, I'll just play through something I'm working on slowly and quietly without vibrato and eventually everything starts to kick in and then that's when I know I'm warmed up. It's also a good time to think about the music while also engaging with the physicality of playing. So I might try that. <laughs> I can't play like this though, let's put you guys somewhere else. This is so weak. <laughs> ah. Day one, day one to three or four always fulfills absolutely terrible, <laughs> even without an injury. <laughs>
got my bad shoulder on one side and my tennis elbow on the other. <laughs> you know, I am 42 years old now. And my friend, who's much younger than me, keeps being like, we've got to get you to a yoga class. <laughs> you can't keep living like this. <laughs> I, d I do need to start looking after myself properly. It's just, it's hard to want to. I don't want to stop drinking or eating or do any exercise. didn't you? Can't turn it off.